What's up guys? So right now at the moment we are actually trying to beat the rain. Um, it's been raining here in Florida for the past like three weeks and what better way to get a landscape to show Florida's landscape in rain. So we're driving to a location that is kind of like in the back country. There's red clay roads and some orange groves. So seeing how that is, you know, seeing what it comes out to. All right, well, what can he do? So yeah, we're on the uh, this red clay road. Um, and it's running parallel to these orange groves that are like rows after rows after rows after orange groves and uh, they're all leading up to this um, this patch of rain that's just falling out of the sky it's quite nice the contrast between the the dark clouds and a little bit of blue patch of the sky off on the left hand side meeting up with the greens and the oranges they look pretty nice for florida by the way so for my camera settings uh, my shutter is at 25th of a second, my f-stop is at 22, and my ISO is below 100, so it's the L on the ISO. L for love, oh, I. <laughs> this picture is actually just uh, the two leading lines of the red clay road and the rows of the orange groves running parallel to one another leading up to the rain falling out of the sky. It's pretty nice. So we shall see right. Yeah, 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 yeah. Right. Alright, hold it. Don't move. There. Yeah. I think I got this shot. So let's go. Let's go find another one. Um, back there, there's some. There's a a dry puddle, and it had like the cracks forming up. Um, I might take my wide lens and um, see if I could get a shot out of that. You know, I think it'd be something different, a little bit. Yo, check that out. Ah, oh, it's. What? This right here is a passion flower. Now it is quite marvelous to look at. It is like an alien kind of flower. If you've never seen one, it's it's pretty cool. Um, I'm super surprised that it's actually growing out here in the wild. Because normally I would see these flowers out in a garden or anything like that. So this is a sight to see. This is quite awesome. So it's very nice. And I'm gonna leave, cause I'm getting bit up by ants. So, awesome. There's also uh, a single tree out in this field right here. Um, hey, let's see. That one, way out there, way out there. So that I would probably uh, use my telephoto lens, and um, there's a nice like patches of green um, that's all around that tree. That actually it's like it's a luscious green. It's it's looks like golf grass. I don't know the the right name for that type of grass, but it's you know that type of grass. It's like you could actually like lay on it. You won't get itchy or anything like that. New Jersey has that kind of grass too. I got relatives up there. So I'm photographing the isolated tree out there that's surrounded by sawgrass and uh, vivid patches of green that breaks up the sawgrass itself. So hopefully it works. I'm at eighth of a second on my shutter. My ISO is an L again for low and my aperture is 32. Yes, I cranked the crap out of that, uh, that aperture. <laughs> 
but um, yeah, I'm, I'm messing around with the exposures of if I'm, you know, using F, uh, F16 to see how it is, or maybe I'll go to F8. So I think I'm gonna get a couple of more images of this location um, and just try to get a, see what I can come up with and then I'll uh, show you guys. So here it is. While I was walking around and exploring, I came to the spot that I was talking about earlier in the video. Um, I got a lot of great images, but before I actually went back to my car and grabbed more of my gear, it started to rain on me, unfortunately. After the rain, all the cracks that were stiffed and raised became soft and relaxed from the water, which allowed it to settle back down to the ground. But I did get the image before it rained and showed like all the like the textures and everything like that. So that's it for this video. If you guys enjoyed watching it, hit the like button. And if you want to see more of the videos that I create, hit the subscribe button. But until then, I'll see you guys in the next video. See you.